A husband and wife shot, one of them dead on the 4th of July. We'll have the latest on the investigation. A wife shot dead, a husband suffering gunshot trauma, and tonight a community wants to know why. It happened at a home on County Road 225 East, that's in rural Moultrie County, about 17 miles southeast of Decatur. ABC News Channel 20's Kimberly Howard has details of this death investigation. The case is being handled by state police who aren't saying much about what went on behind that crime tape. A stretch of road in rural Bethany where you can go miles without seeing a soul. Oh, it's nice. Quiet. It's quiet out here. Nice community. Yeah, friendly. Good farmers, a lot of farmers and all friendly people. Sparsely populated, but news travels fast. Talk some guys over the coffee shop. Especially when the subject is untimely death. We heard the sirens yesterday morning. Answering the 911 call of 66-year-old Michael Robertson. Police say Robertson was asking for help after being shot. His wife, 51-year-old Denise Robertson, was shot too. She died a short time later from a single bullet to the head. Nothing like this ever happens here. It's a small town, very quiet. People leave their houses unlocked. Their cows to graze and chickens to run free. With police saying little about what led up to the shootings, people who live here are fearing the worst. Because that, you know, usually it's a domestic type of thing, but never hurt. If it's outside coming in, that really makes me scared. It seems everybody is trying to find out exactly what went on here. Several cars slowing down on this once deserted county road, craning their necks for those answers. In Bethany, Kimberly Howard, ABC News Channel 20. Police continue to call this a death investigation, not a murder investigation. Neighbors of the victims say the couple has lived in that home for years and they have children who are grown. They say the couple mostly kept to themselves.